Oppo Color OS on your Euphoria. But before installing this ROM, let me tell you that this ROM has three major bugs. The first bug is that Google Play services just does not work. Google Play Store I have tried numerous times but it does not work. Second, camera does not work. I don't know why. Otherwise, if I don't tell you guys now because uh, in the next few videos that I post, you guys will be going mad in the video that you didn't tell us this, you didn't tell us that. So it's better to inform you guys beforehand. And the third thing is that calls do work but there is a weird bug that call interface does not come the, you can hear the call is going on in the earpiece but you cannot see the you cannot see the interface at the loudspeaker or the how to cut the call and stuff so these three were the three major bugs of this rom and if you still want to do it and it's a developer rom basically and it, it's pretty good as a it's pretty good to use it one day if you are do not want to be connected to the outer world and if you do not want to take selfies of yours you do not want to make pictures or see YouTube videos. Hey, what is up, guys? You are to here from Freaks and Geeks, and today back with another video. And this time, today in this video, let's check out the Color OS. You might have heard about the company Oppo, and it's their own software, uh, Color OS, on the U Euphoria. I personally have been looking for this ROM for around 6 months because after it was released for the U Eureka I was pretty impressed with the stability of this ROM and how smooth it works and the beautiful animations but unfortunately couldn't get the ROM for the U Euphoria but finally it was out as I checked yesterday and today I am making another video on colorways on U Euphoria. So pretty much you might be knowing that you need to ensure that you have root access in your device and you have a custom recovery like TWRP or CWM recovery installed on your device. So after that just make sure that uh, yeah I told everything that you need to make sure I guess. Uh, okay make sure part is done then just uh, boot your phone into custom recovery you can do that by pressing the power down button sorry power button and the volume down button together I have already done that as you can see long press them and you shall boot into TWRP recovery so after that just uh, okay let me just increase the brightness guys just hold on a second I'll be back okay so cranked up the brightness a little bit as you can see uh, it's a little bit dark over here because as I told you that my phone was submerged under water and so let's get to the business and let's I will always suggest you that you take a backup so first thing you need to do is you get backup and backup your current software so that if anything goes wrong you can always come back to DWRP recovery running shouting that oh my god I lost my phone I break my phone and stuff and so just come back and just uh, reinstall your software so that's about it and then just go to wipe and select as one swipe dalvik system uh, data wow a lot of noise a lot of noise sorry guys shooting in my veranda as you know dalvik system data and cache and just uh, swipe to wipe and after you are done with that let's just see okay it's it's going to take a bit of time guys so just be patient okay so mine is done so let's just go back and let's keep going back 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 and let's just go install and select the ROM that is ColorOS 2.1 for Euphoria oops selected the wrong thing ColorOS 2.1 Euphoria and just uh, swipe to confirm flash and uh, oopsie it's showing fade what let's just see once again so okay. swipe to confirm flash sorry guys I need to skip that I need to skip that part of the video because uh, I was mistakenly by I was hitting zip signature verification so as you can see error was showing over here and a lot of error and stuff and that's why I it just took me about 10 minutes to figure out what actually was going wrong in this flashing process so do ensure that zip signature verification is unticked because if you do that a lot of ROMs will not work or uh, just do not want to install I, I don't know how it got a ticked and so now I have switched off signature verification and now let's just wait for this ROM to complete flashing so I'm going to fast forward this guys because it's going to take a lot of time I think mm. so as you can see it's, mm, it's uh, done so zip signature verification should be under mm. Sorry guys, it took a lot of time, so I went to eat. Mm, it's tasty. Wow, it is actually good. Thank you. Thank you for the treat. 
ओके 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 थैंक यू सो आफ्टर यूर डन विद दिस यू नीड नॉट फ्लैश एनीथिंग एल्स जस्ट नो ओपन जी एप्स एंड स्टाफ सो नथिंग ऑफ दैट शिट एंड सो जस्ट जस्ट आई नॉट सजेस्ट यू वाइप कैश और डेल्फिक बिकॉज इट्स रियली आई डोंट थिंक इट्स इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर दिस देर इज अ रीजन वाई एम शोइंग दिस टू यू गाइज बिकॉज इफ यू डो नॉट अनचेक जिप सिग्नेचर वेरीफिकेशन दिस काइंड ऑफ एरर यू विल गेट सो डू एंश्योर दैट यूर जिप सिग्नेचर वेरीफिकेशन इज अनटिक्ड एंड सो जस्ट हिट रिबूट सिस्टम सो आफ्टर दैट यू विल बी बूटेड इन टू कलर वेज ओपो कलर वेज या कलर वेज बेसिकली so i'll meet on the other side of the video after it's done booting the very then there is the very first taste of color os that we get it's showing oppo out here and so it should boot quite early but let's just skip this part so after you are booted you will see something like this let's just select english united kingdom and next and so it's india so no issues with that so wifi will uh, okay there is no way we can do okay now okay i really like the keyboard guys it's just so i mean it's just old type and so let's just connect to wifi and this okay connected let's go to next and okay next a lot of and here we come google info and and uh, i read the description and so this uh, guy the developer states that this rom has few bugs and the first bugs and the most major bug that's going to worry you guys which the camera is not working in this device so you can check this out for experimental purposes by i will not suggest if a camera is not working on a device so i will not suggest that you use it as your daily driver so okay wow can't establish a reliable connection okay let's just skip it and next and okay we are done color os yeah That's right. That's how you do it. Getting started. This looks old. This looks Android ice cream sandwich. Oh my god. Look at this guys. Oh my goodness. What the hell is this? It's actually pretty smooth. On the very first boot I can see oh my god how wow. Look at the animation. Wow. This is nice. This is impressive. Color OS is impressive. So let's just see if the camera truly does not work. Battery too low, and we'll do use flash and stuff. Okay, so as you can see, camera does not work. And guys, this ROM is based on Android 5.1.1. I know it's really a bad thing, but I really cannot help it. So no updates. Okay, I am not interested in updates. Just cancel it, man. Okay. Um, let's just go to the Mandela skin tray. And what the hell is this thing? How to close this? Okay. Let's just see more and PG connection. I'm giving you basically uh, some card settings. I will confirm in the description box below that if this uh, ROM supports VoLT or not. And so just do check out the description box below for the download link of this ROM. And so yeah, that is it, guys. That has been Color OS on New Euphoria. Checking out the Color OS on New. Oh my God! Oh my God! That's that's a kick-ass animation, guys. Look at this. It's so satisfying. Whoa. Okay. So that is it, guys. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Do give it a thumbs up if you liked it. And you know, constructive criticism is always welcome. If you have any suggestions, put them in the comment section below. And I know you guys have been liking my videos. Do keep supporting me. Do keep inspiring me for doing more hard work. And until next time, this is Jyoti Tuya from Freaky Geeky. Be freaky geeky and peace out. See you next time.